So what we're going to do today is just explain a little bit about the X line. It was invented by a couple roofers out of Eugene, Oregon. And the whole idea was to cut down on the tripping hazards and increase safety up on the roof. So what they did is they took one of our lifelines and they added an air hose to it. So the X line is your safety lifeline, 30 foot or 50 foot, but we have the air hose integrated into the middle. So if you have three roofers up on the roof, before you had three safety lines and three air hoses and a lot of tripping hazards. So what we did, integrate the two of them. And it's a pretty cool system. The reason why, you hook off to your anchorage point, you run your supply line up to the air hose, and then you take the rope grab, and I'm not wearing a harness right now, but you tie this to the back of your shock absorber, or your side D-ring. Then you take your air hose, or your air gun, and hook it off right here. Mm -hmm. So as you're working, you've got everything right here. You're tied off, and you've got your air flowing through your lifeline, so you can go to work. The problem is, is say you're working on a roof that's only 20 feet deep, and you've got a 50-foot lifeline. That means you're dragging around 30 feet of hose all day long. And a lot of guys didn't like that that much. So what we did yeah, so is we reversed the system. You can use the X line in reverse. You can use the prussic knot, take your rope grab, hook it off to your anchor point. So I'll show that right now. So what the guys are doing is they're taking their prussic, hooking it off to the safety anchor, and the prussic locks in both directions. This is the only rope grab on the market that you can do this with. So all of the slack or extra lifeline is up around the anchor point or on the back side of the house. So the guys take that, they run their supply line up to here. And then you take the air hose and you kind of gently push it over the edge of the roof. And then you take and you pull until you're about two feet past the gutter line. And you take this right here, hook it off to the air shock absorber or to your side D-ring. Take your air gun or your nail gun, hook it off right here. So the only thing chasing you is the dynamic part of the lifeline, right there. So you can go to work. Guys are laying a lot more roofing per day. If you have three or four or five guys up on the roof, they're not tripping over everything. They can be roofers again and not rope managers. Beautiful. Beautiful.